Welcome to A Quick Math Minute with Card Edition. Check it out. Good morning, friends. Welcome back. Okay, I have a very fun, awesome math game to teach you. And all you need is a deck of cards. And what you need is ace through 10. So once you have ace through 10, then replay this video and I'll teach you how to play. So once you have these cards, you can play this game on your own or with someone from your house. And this is the way it goes. You each will have a set of cards from ace to 10. If you're playing on your own, you already have your set. Then what you're going to do is you're gonna take two cards and face them down so you can't see. And on the count of three, you're gonna flip them over and do supertizing and add them together. Are you ready? Let's do this together. I'm playing you. One, two, three. Okay, four plus two more, six. All right, if you said six before me, you would get a tally point or you can use a 10 frame and keep track on here. First one to 10 gets the points. Now, if you said it and maybe you said, oh, seven, oh, you weren't right. The other player that's looking at their cards, they get time to figure it out and use their schema. And if they get the number right, they win. Let's do another one. Are you ready? One, two, three. Ooh, ace is worth one. One plus seven more, or seven plus one more. Eight. Did you beat me? All right, I hope you're keeping score. Let's do one more. I have a feeling this one might be tricky. Are you ready? One, two, three. Six plus three more, or three plus six more. Nine. What did you get? So this is a really great way to practice supertizing. And you know what? Looking at these numbers, doing quick math facts. Now, if you're not quite ready for those big numbers over five, why don't you just keep it simple and pull the numbers one through five out of multiple suits in your deck? How could you modify this game to make sure it's matching your learning? Comment below. Have a wonderful day learning.